What's up, so fresh bride gang? It's your what's so fresh bride here, and I'm back with another freaking video. And today is Vlogmas Day Three. So what's up, y'all? Welcome to the channel. If you're new, I'm so fresh bride, known as Bryson Thompson. So you can call me Bry or Bryson, whatever you want to prefer. We're doing a updated 2022 sneaker collection slash haul. Um, I have a whole bunch of shoes here, y'all. So make sure y'all like this video because that took a long time to get out of the closet. So without further ado, I guess let's get into the video. So I'm gonna start with the shoes that's not in a box, and then we're gonna make our way around, you know, all the shoes, of course. So first things first, we're gonna start with. These Jordans, I don't know what's Jordan. I think these nines, don't correct me if I'm wrong, I'm not like a really sneaker head. But it's some Jordan nines that you know are just play shoes now. You know, basketball or whatever. But some Jordan nines, so we're just gonna start off something light. Next, now these just be my babies, y'all. I think these are Jordan fours. Y'all don't know my Jordan numbers, don't judge me. These just be my baby, but as you see, they very much got they wear and tear, okay? These just be my baby, but you know, they're the beaters now, okay? <laughs> next, let's get into the next pair of shoes. Next, we're gonna do these, y'all. So y'all, I used to like these back in middle school. These are some OG shoes that I used to have. Now they're not like OG, like, oh gosh, you got some OG shoes. But these are like shoes I used to wear all the time. I used to like these shoes a lot. Not no more, I wouldn't wear those Air Moneys. I guess that's what they call all these Nikes. But yeah. Next pair of shoes. Okay, well, let's go ahead with some Gucci gang, Gucci gang, Gucci gang. So we got some Gucci gang, some Gucci slides or whatever. Gucci flip flops, cranking, hit your bitch. Massage, this a big one. So we got some cool little Gucci flip flops. So yeah, for the folks, you know what I'm saying? Gucci flip flops. I only wore these probably like twice. So you can see the bottom is real clear. I bought them in when I was in Hawaii. I um, only wore them once I was in Hawaii. I haven't worn them ever since then. So hopefully I get some use out of these during the summer. But you already know, Gucci gang. Um, next shoe, shoe we're going to be doing is... Let's see what's in like. Oh, let's not forget the Uggs. You already know we got some black Uggs. I'm going to buy some more of these, y'all, because, you know, these are pretty beat. I'm going to buy some, probably some black and some brown with some, some red ones. But for right now, we got these black Uggs. You know, Ugg season coming up. So, you know, these are going to come in handy, but I'm probably not going to wear these. I'm probably going to wear some no. But we got some. All right, y'all. Let's get into the Nike collection. Y'all, let's get into the Nike collection. So, right here, we have some purple Nike Dunks. Now, these I wore probably around five, six times. And as you see, they're pretty creased. And I hate that. Y'all can't really see in the camera because it's like focused on me. But I hate this, y'all, that they're so, they crease so easy. But I do get me some purple Nike Dunks. A lot of people like these, you know, but um, I'm not really a fan of Dunks, honestly. I just bought them just to see what the hype was about. And honestly, it wasn't worth the hype. Honestly, to be honest. But don't, you know what I'm saying, don't turn my head up. Just my opinion. Next, let's go with the next pair of Nikes. Next, we got my little running man shoes. You know, these are the shoes I'll go work out in whenever I do work out. Um, they're pretty comfy. They got these at the bottom for, you know, I don't know. But I guess they like better grip on the ground. I'm not sure. I just know I like the color pattern. It was pretty cool. That's just some, you know, some running shoes or whatever. All right. Let's go with, both of these are Air Forces, y'all. Both of these are White Forces. You know, we gotta always keep a pair of these. And then another pair of these. You know, we like the, we love forces over here. But yeah, just two pair of forces. Next, let's get into this Nike box, which is some Jordan ones. Let's see what they are. Oh <laughs> yes! These are um what the breads? I think these are called breads. Um these are called Air Jordan Retro High OGs. So yeah, y'all, everybody love these, y'all. How can you hate these, y'all? These shoes is so nice. Now, I only wear these shoes a few times, y'all. Well, I probably wore them probably about 10 times. You saw they ain't got no crease. They still look pretty brand new. Cause I barely wear shoes, y'all, to be honest. I have a lot, of, I got all these shoes, and I mainly just wear Crocs every day in the phone runners. But I do got these Jordan ones, OG Retro Highs. Don't, y'all please don't come for me in the comments. <laughs> but yeah, got these. All right, let's go to the next shoe. 
All right, guys. So we got these, some more Jordan ones. So these are the Air Jordan Rich. Oh, they all say Rich Rod. That's not what they call. But I got these right here, y'all. These bad boys. Yes, I have never worn these, y'all. Had this for about three, four months. I got them when they first came out for retail. I got this for retail because I bought them at Hibbit Sports for like 170. You know, obviously these go for like 300. Resellers, we sell this for like 300. I bought these for like 170. But I do got these, y'all. I never wore them. I was debating if I should sell them or something, but I'm not really good. Well, I'm not saying I'm not gonna say I'm not good at selling stuff, but I just never really got into the selling resale business. But you know, these are size 12s. So if anybody interested, hit me up. You know, you know what I'm saying? Make up, you know, the make up of dollars. I got you because I still haven't worn them because I can't find these color. This color is so hard to find. I haven't even tried this shoe on. The other one is just like this. The other one's not laced up either. So yeah, never wear these. You know what I'm saying? Hit me up. Hit me up, okay? <laughs> All right, so let's go to the next shoe. All right, so we're gonna start. We gotta go ahead. Should we wait for the, you know, the designer? I think we're gonna wait on the designer. We're gonna wait for the designer. We're gonna go. We're just gonna. We're gonna stay slight, and we're gonna wait for the. We're gonna say the best for that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. All right. Next, we got these Jordans right here. These bad boys. Um, these are Jordan Eleven. Don't know what they're called, but these Jubilees. These are the Jubilees. Um, Jordan 11 Jubilees, you know. And these were so hyped up. When these first came out, everybody their mama had these. I thought everybody their mama got these. And everybody their mama wanted these shoes so bad. But yeah, the Jordan Jubilees or whatever, y'all. They're really nice, comfy. Not comfy, let me not lie. But they're really nice. I still wear these to the top from time to time. Not really. Y'all know I don't really wear shoes like that. But when I do, you know, give me stepping. Next. We got the, ooh, we got the Cool Grays in here. Now I know the name of these. Oh, we got the Cool Grays on. So let me pull them out the box. Ooh, the lid's off. Oh! I'm dropping stuff, I'm dropping the camera. Battery. Um, Got the Cool Grays. Fun fact about the Cool Grays though, you all. Actually, my supporters, you guys, actually bought me these shoes last year for Christmas. Um, We raised like, a thousand dollars and I bought these shoes and I bought some other shoes. Don't remember what else I bought. But y'all had raised up a thousand dollars in live. Y'all cashed at me because I said I wanted these shoes for Christmas. I didn't get them. And y'all was like, well, boy, you get what you want. And y'all sent me the money. So thank y'all. I would never forget. These are the first pair of shoes my supporters bought me. I love y'all so much. But yeah, I haven't worn, I wore them a few times, but thank y'all for the shoes, okay? Give me one second. Hour later. All right. We're back. So, the next shoes is in this Nike box. I'm not sure what this is. Box kind of beat up. But, oh, some more running shoes, y'all. Just some shoes, you know, to go to the gym with. Go on a little jog with or something. You know, walking. Sometimes, believe it or not, I know I'm kind of, yeah. You know, sometimes, you know, I go on a little walk from time to time. But, yeah, these are some little walk shoes or whatever. Or whatever. Just something slight. Something slight just to walk in. All right. We're going to wait for the Crocs. We're not going to do the Croc collection yet. We're gonna start with this collection right here. So I guess we're gonna start with the top. I have never wore these yet, but these are some Birkenstocks, you know. Um, I wanted these so bad, and when I got them, I never wore them. As you see the bottom, clean, never wore them, fresh out of the box. <sighs> I had these shoes for probably about eight months, nine months. I bought them at the beginning of the year. It's December. It's time to give it up, okay? <laughs> like, I really wasted my money on these, but maybe one day I'll wear them, hopefully. I be forgetting I have them, y'all. I just be so, I be so raised on Crocs and Yeezy runners, y'all. I, I need to do better. Next pair of shoes. We got some a Jordan. So these are these purple and black Jordan 11. No, it's not 11. These are 12s. Black and purple Jordan 12s. I think it's called like dark purple. Dark something. I know it's called dark something. Dark Concord. Dark, dark Concord. Black, yeah, dark, yup, dark Concord. These real nice, so I bought these because I seen funny white by the back use these. And I was like, oh my gosh, I have to get those. And I got these for retail, too. I was like, I gotta get those. And hey, <laughs> I caught them, okay? Shout out to funny white in the back kids. Next box, we got some sixes. So y'all, this is what these look like. These kind of beat up y'all, but these are so fly and hard, y'all. You know what I'm saying? These is really nice. Look at the inside. The inside is hard, Joy. These are nice, okay? 
get into the shoes, okay? Dang, y'all. Y'all, the shoe stack is getting almost to the ring light, y'all. And that's from the ground up. Hopefully, this don't fall. This is going to fall. I'm going to not stack no more shoes right there because I don't want that to fall. Because I don't have time to clean up all that. You know, girl, they have a lot to clean up. Next. <laughs> Make sure y'all like this video, y'all. All these shoes took me a minute to get out of the closet and stack correctly without falling. So y'all make sure y'all like, make sure y'all like this video. Make sure y'all subscribe to the channel. We are on the road to 20,000 subscribers. So if you haven't subscribed yet, make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn that post notification bell on. Thank you. Next, we got the, I think these are called Oreos. I'm not sure what these are called either. These are called, they don't say, but these shoes, I love these shoes. I'm actually gonna wear these this weekend because I'm gonna go out of town and that vlog will be up tomorrow. So make sure you tune into my Travel With Me vlog. I'm gonna wear these tomorrow to the little party I'm going to, y'all. I like these shoes, y'all. Here, y'all. These shoes are flyer. <laughs> but yeah, we got these shoes. I think they're called Oreos, but I'm not sure what they're called, but they're hard. And these are what, four, fives or fours? These are Jordan fours. Yeah. Okay, next pair of shoes. We got the Adidas, 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 Adidas. Some more running shoes, y'all. Get some play shoes. Nothing too much, nothing too much. Nothing major, nothing major. And then, you know, another pair of OG phase okay? All right. Next pair of shoes, we're gonna start with this row. We still got a lot of shoes to go, y'all. I know, y'all probably like, God damn, what? Anyways. These are some Christmas shoes I bought a while back. I love these shoes, honestly, y'all. There's some cute little Christmas shoes. Like, don't count my name. Say no. But these are just some barrel shoes for Christmas, you know. I like to make little videos of these. I just brought about three years or so. But you know, still be rocking them or whatever. They, they ain't gonna ever get old, okay? Never. Next, um, we got these shoes right here. These are some barrel shoes I have never worn, or I might have worn once. I have bought these from like, a shoe store, like a shoe department or something. I'm not sure, but I bought them because they're so comfy and so soft, but I still never wore them. One never wore them to the airport, but I ain't got the comp. Yes, please, no. Please, y'all. Please don't fall. Hold up, y'all. Break check, break check, break check. Please do not fall. Okay, it's good. It's good. It's not gonna fall. It's not gonna fall. Okay. Next, we got some champions. We got some champions, y'all. So these are, never wore these before, but these are some champions, slippers, some bedroom shoes, or whatnot. Just some cute, comfy shoes to throw on, even though I never wore them. But there are some, you know, some just comfy shoes, just throw on, you better go to the gas station, throw them bitches on, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> keep it simple, keep it simple. Okay. Next shoe. Oh, I done dropped it. Oh, we got some more forces. <laughs> I think these are brand new. No, I wore these. Y'all, I got so many pairs of damn horses, y'all. You can never have so many pairs of horses. I might buy me a new pair this weekend. Okay. But that's the top point. Next, we got my faves. These are absolutely my favorite shoe, which are my phone runners. These are my favorite shoe, y'all, just because they're my everyday shoe, y'all. I love these shoes. <laughs> but yeah, y'all, I'm not lying, though, y'all. I wear these shoes every day, y'all. You can't even see the Adidas on the wall. Yes, you can. I'm lying. But I only got a grip on these shoes no more. I wear these shoes like every single day. If it's not these, it's my freaking arm um, crops. I love these shoes, they're so comfortable. They just everyday slip on shoes. It's the new color, so you can wear this with anything. White, black, red, orange, green, you can wear it with anything. That's why I love those so much. And they're so comfortable. I never thought UV foam runners was gonna be that comfortable until I bought a pair. <sighs> and I'm gonna buy me some more pairs soon. And I got this other pair of UV runners. These aren't as comfortable, but I do got me some red ones. They're cute. This red is so hard to find, honestly, but what kind of match? it looks like it matches this, but in real life, it really doesn't. The marriages are not the same, but I do wear these quite a bit. I wear these when I go to the beach mainly though. These shoes get so much sand in them from day to day. But yeah, just some red um, Yeezy Foam Runners. I recommend Yeezy Foam Runners. They're such a good quality. I didn't think so. I was like, who's paying that much money for some basically um, more advanced Crocs? But they feel way better than Crocs, respect. No shady Crocs though, I love Crocs. Next, some Jordan 11 Lows. These are, I don't know what they're called, but there's some blue and white Jordan Lows. That's what they look like. So yeah, 
These are very old. I had these for a little minute, but yeah. This is an OG. These ain't OG, but y'all get it. Um, next. Ooh, I thought this was about to fall. Next, y'all. Uh, oh, ooh. these are some Jordan 11s too. These are the low top bread 11s. These used to be my favorite shoes of all time. I bought, matter, matter of fact, these are the shoes I bought. These are like the first pair of shoes I bought when I started making like pretty good money for myself, for my age. These are like the first shoes I bought. So these shoes will always have a deep meaning to me. Yeah. They've been through some things. They've been through some things. They've been through some things. I think this was actually my first pair of shoes I bought myself, if I'm not mistaken. Even though I got ripped off when I paid bottom, that was like almost $400. But now they only like one temperature change. So they, they age very badly, respectfully. Next we got these y'all. If you know, you know. Got some Jordan mids. At back then, I didn't care about a Jordan mid and a fucking OG. I didn't care about none of that. I just cared about what the shoe looked like. And this shoe was really hard, honestly. But I don't wear mids like that no more. Since I know what mids are now. Even though there's nothing wrong with mids, y'all. I still fuck with mids. But I just don't wear them like that no more. But yeah, these are sweet or whatever. When I bring these out, people are like, ooh, what are those called? Because they're so old and no, they don't sell them no more. So a lot of people don't really know about those. Next shoe. We got some more mids. So these are the Chicago mids. Y'all, I used to wear these shoes out. These was my favorite shoes for it. These was like my second favorite. It was the Jordan 11s and these was my favorite too. Let me see. Just some Jordan um, mids. Some Jordan 1 mids. Air Jordan mids. Let's put it back. All right, y'all, so, uh, should we do designer or Crocs? I think we should go ahead and go into the, <laughs> the expensive drip. Or do we say the expensive for last? I don't know, I'm for real, I don't know. I'm for real, I don't know. Y'all, let me move this to the side, because that's, in a way, I don't know how that looks. All right, y'all, well, we're gonna do the Croc collection, and we're gonna say the best for last. Let's get into it. So now, we got some orange Crocs. Yo. We're going to make this fast, y'all, because it's Crocs, right? I'm say. We got the rainbow Crocs. I wore these out, as you can tell. We got the blue Crocs. Keep them comfortable. We got the purple Crocs. I just got these. Me and my brother got match ones. Then we got... We got these black... Tied a rainbow is croc or well, tied a croc. We call these tied on, and then we got these. I got these fake easy slides. Yes, these are fake. Got these from Instagram. We'll see for like $20. Ain't no shame in my game. I went about to spend two, three hundred dollars on some easy slides, but then I got some easy phone runners, and now it makes sense. I don't know what's wrong with me, but hey, I did what I did because I ain't have no choice. And a little baby's voice, but now it's time for the expensive drip. So let's get into the expenses. So first we got some Balenciaga, yeah. Some Balenciaga. Now you know, I know Balenciaga is going through a lot of heat right now, and I know they're canceled, but I'm sorry y'all, I cannot burn my babies. Sorry y'all, these shoes right here alone was $1,400 basically. $3,550 plus the tax, yeah. I can't burn that much money, I'm sorry y'all. If I knew that before, I wouldn't have bought them, but they already bought now. So, let's pull these bad boys out. So let's pull out the Balenciaga Aga. Boom, these are the black lead Balenciagas. Um, if y'all know what lead means, they change colors, y'all. Then y'all can't see it. Why y'all can't see it? It's on. Let me turn the light off. Don't be calling me all dark skin stuff. Don't be racist. Oh, actually good. Okay, so this is red. Blue, green, purple, light blue, greenish yellow, blue, another white, this must be white, flashing white, and then it's like rainbow. And then that's all the settings. You get to turn off. Turn off! Oh. But yeah, I used to say I would never pay that much money for no Balenciagas. But guess what? I got um. <laughs> but yeah, some Balenciagas. I like the lighting like this. I should have been recording in this kind of light. This light looks good to me. All right. We're going to finish the rest of the video in this kind of lighting. Because I'm with this light in the wall. 
All right, next, we got my favorites, my favorite designer shoes, which are the Dolce and Gabbana. Y'all, these are my absolute favorite designer shoes. I wear these shoes like every other day, respectfully. Any trip I go on, I automatically take these, y'all. If you, if, you, if, if you ask my family, they'll tell you they sell. So yeah, I got some Dolce Kamana, y'all. Actually, y'all, this was a gift from a company I worked with. These was around 800 and some change, but they bought them for me. Yes, I love you, y'all. I tap mom. Shout out to y'all, gang, gang. But yes, y'all, these are my favorites. I feel like it's because it's such versatile colors that I can wear blue with it, green with it, pink with it, dark pink, light pink, red. You know what I'm saying? I can wear all types of colors with these. I can throw on white shirt and wear these. You know what I'm saying? So that's why I like these shoes so much. Yes, right. And if y'all see me smiling in the video, that's just me trying to get thumbnails and stuff. Y'all, you know, if you're a YouTuber, you get it. You know what I'm saying? YouTuber gang. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shout out to y'all. Next. Next, we got some Versace. We got some Versace. Now, these shoes retail at like over $1,000, but I got them on sale. Oh, well, they don't even show the price on here. I got them on sale for $500, but the retail price is like, I think this was like $800. I'm not sure. Y'all have to look up the prices. But there's some Versace. These are my first and only Versace. Oh! These are my Versace, so are real nice and sleek. I wear these every now and then. They're so heavy, though, y'all. They are very, 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 very heavy. But these are what they look like, y'all. They're pretty nice, though. Just a heavy shoe, though. All my designer shoes are pretty heavy. The Balenciaga's are heavy. These shoes are very heavy. Those Shagabanas, those are pretty heavy on my feet, too. But, yeah. Next, we got the Gucci Gang, Gucci Gang, Gucci Gang. Been like that on the gold chain. My new bit by murdering. Uh, 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 uh. Whatever old dude said. Matter of fact, what happened to Lil Pump? Anyway, that's not what this video's about. We got some the Gucci gang. So, let's pull out the Gucci gang, Gucci gang. Oh, y'all, I'm gonna have to take this out of this bag. Give me a second, y'all. These was like $800, I think. Correct me if I'm wrong. I'm not 100% sure, but these are the tennis um, Gucci's. There's some cute little tennis shoes. Red bottom, red bottom. This is what really sold me the red bottom. But yeah, these are Gucci, y'all. Y'all see how dirty they are? Yeah, I wear these quite a bit. But yeah, these are some red bottom ones. Jeez. Put them down. But yeah, these are the Gucci 997s. Um, yeah, that's all. I don't know much about the shoe. But yeah, they're nice. Calm. You know what I'm saying? A different look for me. I guess designer um designer conversion. <laughs> Basically. Uh where's the video? Alright, next y'all. Ooh y'all. We got some more uh, Balenciaga. Aga, Aga. And again, sorry y'all. I already have bought them before all this mishap had happened. So don't judge y'all. Don't read me in the comments, y'all. Don't read me, baby, please. Please don't read me for having the Balenci. Yeah, these are some red ones, y'all. These are pretty, y'all. I don't care what I'm about to say. These are cute. Um, yo, I paid eleven hundred for these shoes just for them to go on sale at Neiman Marcus for four hundred dollars, five hundred dollars. I was so mad. I seen these on the freaking Karen's right. Literally, y'all, two weeks before I bought them. Once in the markets, I was like, oh my gosh, those are so nice. I like them so much. Spent almost $1,200, actually. I'm going to spend $1,200 on these. Just for them to go on a clearance rack two weeks later. So, y'all, guys, be patient. Because around Christmas time, around this crime right here, is when they start having their Christmas racks and Christmas sales. I think it's this time, or it's earlier in the year, where they start having stuff on sale. So, just know, y'all, y'all could have had these for the low. And I missed my chance. But they're really nice, sleek, real nice, cute, whatever. Yeah, some cute little Balenciaga goggles. Balenciaga goggles or whatever. All right, next y'all, we got my favorite designer. Now, Balenciaga was my favorite designer. It was Balenciaga and Burberry, but you know, y'all already know. But Burberry is my second favorite designer. Well, I just love Burberry colors. It's like that brown is so unique and beautiful. <laughs> All right, let's get into these. 
Um, let me pull it out. So these are the Burberryanas. Burberry. Yes, you are. I paid eight hundred dollars for these two. Um, but yeah, y'all, these are Burberry. Yeah. Let me know what y'all think. Let me know what y'all think. This is some Burberry, cute little Burberry brown shoes. I got the bag to match, so I got the bag and the shoes to match these. They're real nice, real sleek, real cute. They're really hard, and you can't wear them for more than three hours without your feet hurting. But other than that, they're really nice, and I wear them quite a bit because they, you know what I'm saying, they're hard. But yeah, y'all, that concludes, that concludes, oh, well, hold up. Bitch, that was a fail. And I got these Crocs too that I'm wearing. And then I was gonna show y'all this, but I don't want y'all to bully me. I don't want y'all to bully me. My bad, y'all. But don't be looking at my booty if it's showing. Y'all, these are some OGs, y'all. They so dusty. Y'all, I have, I cannot wear this size no more, y'all. These are some old shoes I had from when I was a kid. Look how dusty it is. These are a size nine. I wear size 12 now. That's so crazy, y'all. These are some OG shoes that I used to love. Me, my sister had matching ones. I used to love these so much. Ew, y'all, look how much dust it. Ugh. These are some OG shoes for me. But that concludes this um video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what kind of other videos y'all want for Vlogmas down in the comments down below. Please, please, please double tap this video. This was so much, y'all. I gotta clean up this whole bedroom. I gotta reorganize my whole room, reorganize all my shoes. So please, please, please make it worth it, y'all, by hitting the like button. It's free. And ho who congratulations to the winner of the card giveaway. And remember, y'all, every single video I do for Vlogmas, I'm gonna be adding a gift card code somewhere in the video. So make sure you didn't miss out on that. You might have to rewind if you want paying attention, but you better pay attention to my videos, okay? Other than that, y'all, like and subscribe. I'm out. I love you guys. Thank you for watching this video. Peace.